Steelers um, Cardinals game. Okay. And it's really just a prop. Um, the Cardinals are the worst team against the rush. They just gave up 140 yards to uh, Williams from the Rams. And before that, the, the, the story continues. So uh, Najee Harris has been running the ball pretty well of, of late. He had 100 yards. I think his first 100-yard game of the year last year. And I think he has a pretty decent game this year. But I'm going with Najee to score. Um, just the way this team is built, they're not going to really throw the ball. Dante Johnson, I believe, has um, a, a sick, so I'm not sure if he's going to be 100. percent But I don't mind. Is he, it. Give me is he sick or is he sick? Because all the bullshit he's been pulling. Yeah, I don't someone know. On his, someone on his team might have told him to stay the fuck home. Yeah, I'm not sure. I mean, we're early, right? It's still Thursday, so yeah, we'll see. Come, but you Sunday. know what I'm saying? That would be that would be un, that would be pretty. Uh, Pretty weird timing for him to be sick. Yeah, <laughs> it was. Bullshit he pulled last week. Mm -hmm. But give me Najee Harris to score. Uh, I think he. I think he scores in this game. Like I said, uh, the Arizona Cardinals are the worst team in the league against the run. They also just relieved Zach Ertz. Um, this yeah. team is going the opposite direction. Zach Ertz just got released. Um, Hollywood it's Brown is hurt. Draft season in Arizona. Yeah, and I think the backup tight end has a groin injury. McBride has a groin injury, so um, you know it's time that they're looking at head. They're showcasing. The only reason, really, why Murray's playing is because they're showcasing him. Really, at this point, you know, you know, for trade. Yeah, bait, so. that or he's making all that money, so he's got to play. It's one or the other. Yeah, that's true. That's true. That's true too. But give me Najee Harris to score. I think um, Najee Harris to score here and. I just don't – Murray's going to have a tough game here. I actually would lean Pittsburgh, but I just can't bat Kenny no. Pickett, who has six touchdowns on the year, and he's been a starting quarterback for the whole goddamn year. I can back Steelers as a small favorite or, a, or an underdog. I cannot back the Steelers as five-and-a-half-point favorites. Their offense yeah, I just can't. has not deserved that kind of love, in my opinion. Yeah. I like, agree. this is almost getting to the point where I would lean Arizona – I just do on, our, just yeah. on the points, like I don't think Arizona could win the game, but I think Kyler Murray could keep it within a field goal. Yeah, I agree. I agree. I definitely agree. Um, My only thing just, would be, I mean, I feel like you know it's almost becoming auto bet, but I mean, TJ Watt's probably going to get a sack, right? <laughs> like, I mean, yeah. Arizona's got bad offensive tackles. Um, yeah, well, let's, I, let's I shouldn't say bad. I, Paris Johnson's a rookie, so they've got one bad offensive tackle and then a rookie. So, I mean, yeah. T.J. Watt's probably getting a sack. If you're seeing this video right now, that means you made it to the end. So, congratulations. You are now almost officially part of the money team. Money How do you become a part of the money team? If you're new to the channel, you have to hit the subscribe button. We want to blow this brand up. It's not me versus you or us versus them. It's us versus the sports book. Us versus the bookman, aka the boogeyman. So make sure you're on the winning side and the winning team. I got bonus content up here for you guys to choose from. Make sure you tell a friend to tell a friend. This is Moss Money. This is Money Pot. This is Money Pot Betting.